So, hey, saints, it's Sister with a Testimony. I'm, I'm so excited this morning. It's like, wow. I came to you this morning with a breakfast prayer, okay? Not your everyday church prayer, saints. Not an Arnold Schwarzenegger prayer. But the Terminator prayer. Jesus of the Bible prayer. You know, God in the flesh. I'm talking Lord's Prayer here. The prayer for healing is for your breakfast prayer time. I mean, it'll make you a preacher with great faith prayer time. The only breakfast prayer you'll ever need. Come on, saints. Get excited about this. This is your devotion to Scripture, your breakfast of champions prayer. So, I just want to dive right in, and a uh, little technical difficulty there. Check this out. When you take medicine for your breakfast prayer, when you take the Word of God, the Bible, Jesus, the Lord's Prayer, and you ingest it, and that's the breakfast of champions I'm talking about, spiritual breakfast prayer here. Speak this out daily. Jesus is the Lord of your life. Sickness and disease have no power over you. Declare and decree, I am forgiven. I am free of sin and guilt. I am dead to sin and alive unto righteousness. This is scripture. This is breakfast prayer time. I am free from unforgiveness. I am free from strife. I forgive others. I forgive everybody. Saints, it's time that we woke up. I'm talking about breakfast of champions. Jesus, the true terminator. Saints, we have the love of God shed abroad in our hearts by the Holy Spirit. Jesus bore your sins on the cross. That's what you need to be proclaiming. He bore your sins on that tree. Therefore, you are dead in Christ and alive forevermore unto God. And you are healed by Christ's stripes. This morning, be healed by Christ's stripes. Claim it. Jesus bore our sicknesses and carried our pain. Don't give place to the devil. Declare and decree, therefore, because Jesus bore my sins, because Jesus bore my sins and all my iniquities, my diseases, my sicknesses, anything. Stop claiming my this, my that. Say, my healing. I give no place to sickness or pain in the name of Yahushua Hamashiach, for Jesus Christ is the Word of God, and God the Father, Yahuwah, sent His Word, and He healed them, saints. That's you. That's me. Father, because of Your Word, I am an overcomer. I overcome the world through faith. The flesh is overcome by the word and through faith. The devil himself is overcome. In this breakfast prayer, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the blood of the lamb hides, protects, and keeps me. According to Revelation chapter 12, verse 11, we overcome saints. By the blood of the Lamb, the word of our testimony, not loving our life unto death. Father God, you have given us abundant life. I receive that life through your word and it flows to every organ in my body. And it brings healing. It brings help, Father God. I thank you, Heavenly Father. I tend to your word. I incline my ear, Father God, to hear your voice. Father God, your word is engrafted upon my heart. I am healed by Christ's stripes. I will not allow your word to depart from my eyes. I will keep your word before my eyes, 
in the midst of my heart because I know that they are lifting me up and they are healing me. All my flesh comes to life when I hear your word, Father God. As you were with Moses, you will be with me, Father God. I will fear no evil, for you are with me. My eyes will never dim, neither will my natural forces be abated, because my eyes are blessed, and they see, and my ears are blessed, and they hear. No evil shall befall me. Saints, no evil shall befall you if you have faith. If you have faith. No evil shall befall you, neither shall any plague come near your dwelling. For Father God has given angels charge over you. They will keep you in all your ways and in your pathway. In your pathway is life, Father God. In your path is healing. In your path is health. Father God, I thank you because Yahushua took my infirmities and he bore my sicknesses therefore i refuse to allow sickness to dominate my body refuse to allow sickness to dominate your body saints the life of yahuwah flows within us bringing healing to every fiber every part of us you are redeemed from the curse of the law Galatians 3.13 is your go-to scripture for this. You have been redeemed from the curse of the law. There is no more sickness and disease in you because you've been redeemed from the curse of the law. The, the blood of Jesus is in you. The Ruach HaKadosh is in you. The spirit of holiness flowing to every cell of your body. Restoring life and health. Saints, I declare and decree today, according to the word of God, you are healed by Christ's stripes. If you're healed, then declare it. It'll manifest in your body when you believe it. You might be sick. You might be feeling bad. It might look bad. But saints, I'm going to tell you something. You've got to have the faith that you know that he paid the penalty he paid the penalty so if the penalty has been paid you've got to claim it and you've got to act as if the word is already there healing you calling forth your healing until it manifests you tell your body this is my breakfast prayer this is my spiritual breakfast. This is my day of devotion to the scripture. It is my breakfast of champions. Saints, this should be our breakfast prayer. Not an everyday church prayer. Not an Arnold Schwarzenegger Terminator prayer. But the Terminator. The Terminator that healed your sickness and your disease. Name it. I'm healed. Claim it. I receive it by faith. Now body manifest it in Yahushua's name. Father, I just praise you and I thank you. As I claim healing over my brothers and sisters, I'm in agreement with their healing. I'm in agreement with their wholeness. Father God, let their breakfast prayer resound and Lord let them go throughout their day with a praise on their lips and thanksgiving in their hearts saints I plead and apply the blood of Yahushua Hamashiach over you to hide protect and keep you a sister with a testimony praying with you and for you I love you God bless you